Hello, you two. Soccer number 10 members. It's Uncle Dennis. Hey, on the Soccer number 10 show, today we have none other than our very beautiful guest all the way from Mexico here. Hi, my name is Mariana Gonzalez, and I'm a nutritionist from Mexico. Well, today we'll be talking about soccer odors. Yeah, soccer odors. I know you, I hope you like my new hairstyle. I got a few emails yesterday from members saying, Dennis, where's your hair? I say, uh, I cut it off. They say, you can't go here, that's why. Well, hey, I got this new potion called the Fast Air Grow. It, pff, instant air grow. Well, today we'll be talking about soccer odors. For many soccer players out there, you know, after you play a few ball and you're running and you come back, your arm is wet, you smell like two pigs rubbing together in the mud or some grizzly beer having fun. But today we have a specialist here who has some unusual ingredients that I think really works. So are you saying that for soccer players, I'm not going to show products, they they can go buy expensive product like these at the Walmart. Let's say that's a typical. Uh, it's a what you call it odor eliminator technology. And I'm not gonna you know kill the product really. It's a Gillette product. Yeah, they'll kill it. Tell the truth, Uncle Dennis. Just tell you the truth. So what are you saying about these things now? Special degrees and all these dry products. What are you saying, um, specialist? Uh, well, these products actually they have a lot of aluminium. And aluminum is a non metal that can cause you cancer. <gasps> cancer? You're saying to me that if I use a deodorant, that it. So, hold on. Let me see if my chemistry 101 works. So, aluminum is non metal, right? And it's toxic, right? So, if it's right. toxic, then chances are if you have it under your arm, it's going to be wet real fast, right? Right. And. That's the reason why there is a lot of cancer right now. Um, in this year, they found, uh, well, this year they found that um, that most of the deodorants, they have a lot of aluminum that cause cancer in women and guys. So many top professional soccer players, after having their showers and they want to look good, MLS and UEFA Cup and all that, we always go and use a shave or arms, you know, trying to smell fresh. What what are some remedies that you could suggest that mm -hmm. will uh, healthy that is not toxic to the body and that will kind of give you a a better smelling and keep your arm dry without using all these dangerous unproved FDA stuff? What would you suggest? What I recommend to my clients is using um, this product, which is really nice. It's Milk of magnesium. What? Right? What? This product is really Isn't good. that something they drink with your tummy? Yeah, but actually help you to um, dry your sweat. <gasps> and you only have to use like um, wet, wet some cotton with this type of milk. And you have to make sure that it's original because it has cherry. But you have to make sure that it's only... Um, uh, it doesn't have any flavor. It's only milk of magnesium. Or the white, milk. the real white, pure milk of magnesium, the laxative. And it's yeah. an You're saying you can get this in a look. I mean, normally, I mean, hey, I'm a soccer guy. Sometimes I smell like a beer, you know, playing out there all day, coming in, <laughs> smelling really, uh, especially when you take off those cheesy socks. Uh, so, so you're saying if I should try this on my arm, you know, my arm is not so so bad, you know what I'm saying, it's kind of okay, when you play soccer, it's, you're out there running, you gotta, you know, smell like a man, you know what I'm saying, not like a bear or a gorilla, okay, so, let's try this, I want to be a, a demonstrator, let's try this, well, you have to follow the, follow the instructions, you have to make sure that first you have to shake it well, right, and then, Gonna Am I going to lose my arm? Hey, and make sure your arm is well shaven. Make sure yeah. it's shaved. Look, there's no sweat under my arm. I've never get complained that, hey, Lee, you smell like a little monkey, man. <laughs> okay, so what we have in these apparatus right here? This is some cotton balls, right? 
right? I'll be the demonstrator, and you're gonna just apply gently. Do not hurt exactly. me. Do not let me die. Please, I want to live forever. Okay. okay. Oh, oh yes. Oh, ah, 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 I am melted. Help me! And then you have to make sure that you dry it. But Chris, if you don't Should dry I get a it, fan out, or something? <laughs> I don't think so. You can make sure that you dry it with your hands. So, because if, if it's not well dry, you will smell that. You have to make sure that it's well dry. And oh, if it's covered with so the natural, cold. you don't get cancer. And if you don't believe me, you can go check online and you can check about the mix, milk of magnesium. I feel like somebody turned on an AC onto my arm. Woo! So are you saying that this is basically going to keep me dry? Let's say I'm a guy who likes yeah. to wear a suit to a function. I, like me, I go to seminars a lot and do seminars a lot. So can you do this other arm, please? And you have to make sure that you um, wet a new cotton, okay? Okay, it's a new cotton. <laughs> well, sorry. Um, use um, a different cotton, okay? Ooh, I feel my arms are feeling really dry, really. I've never done this. I've always used, like, um, the dry powder um, before soccer games and so forth. I've never tried it. So you're basically saying this will help me to keep my arms dry. Right. And let's say I'm, where I'm at a function, a real function, and I'm standing out there in the sun, and my arm is dripping like someone turned on water under my arm. Are you saying that this will help me kind of keep me dry? Exactly. Actually, a lot of girls, they're using it as a primer in their face. Uh, like, I always use it because my, my face is kind of shiny. So I put it in my face and this helped me to have a, um, uh, to get, to don't have more shine in my face. And this also helps the guys and the women to don't sweat. This is going to help you. This is 100% natural. Well, hey, YouTube. You know me, Uncle Dennis. Just try to keep it real. If this, um, this thing doesn't work, what I would do is, I'll let you know. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to try it out for a few days. I'm going to wear my suit during the, like, you know, during one of my seminars or workshop. And, I mean, I've been using different type of deodorants. And sometimes when you mix deodorants, it somehow mess your, your, because you're using different aluminum, as you say, right? Right. And um, if my Chemistry 101 served me right, um, milk of magnesium consists of magnesium, and when you mix a magnesium oxide or something with uh, alkaline, well, it just forms something, right? It re right. All right. So, hey, chemistry 101. Hey, <laughs> soccer number 10, hey, members out there, you saw me, did it live. I'm going to wait till it dry. I'm feeling really cool, and I'm not feeling the sweat. So I'll give it a couple more days, and then, hey, I'll tell you a review what I think about this product, if it works or not. And I'll tell you, hey, my arm is melting! You know. First time you saw me, I'm the guinea pig right now. Live on Justin TV, YouTube. Hey, my guess? Stop wasting money, okay? Buy milk of magnesia, and you will see the results. Soccer number 10, yeah. say we love you all. Stay fit, stay sexy, stay out of trouble. And stay skinny like me.